In today's video, what I'm going to be doing is showing you how you can transfer a YouTube channel from one Google account to another one, essentially moving your YouTube channel. It is an easy process, but it's going to take about seven days to complete the entire process. And you'll find out why as we go through the process right now. First thing you want to do is go into YouTube Studio and from here, what we're going to do is go into settings and in settings, we're going to go into permissions. You can see right here at the top, it says keep managing permissions in your brand account. So what we want to do is go here and click on manage permissions. You can see it says brand account details and it has my name, YouTube tutorials. What I want to do is go to users right here. It says manage permissions so I can go ahead and change roles, invite people, remove users. Let's go ahead and do that. And right now I have to sign in with my password. So let me go ahead and do that now. Because after signing in, go ahead and click on manage permissions again. So you can see it says invite new users right here. When I hover over this at the top right, from here, all I need to do is add an email and choose a role. So you have different roles as far as a manager, communications manager or an owner. So what I want to do is add this person as an owner. And then I'm going to go ahead and put in a name here. All right. And after that, all I have to do is invite them. So this is my second email is invited as an owner. I go ahead and press done. So what I need to do is go over into my other email and accept that invitation. And you can see after I switched over to that account, it says accept invitation, become an owner of YouTube tutorials. I'm going to go ahead and accept that. And what I can do from here is go back to manage permissions, have to sign in again. So let me go ahead and do that. And you can see if I try to make myself a primary owner. So if I do transfer, you can see right here at the bottom left that I cannot do it unless I have been a owner for at least seven days. Now on the eighth day, you can go ahead and make yourself the primary owner just like I was about to do. We're coming up here and actually clicking transfer. There's only going to be one primary owner. So the primary owner can delete any other owners or managers that are up here. The owner can delete managers as well, but they cannot delete the primary owner because I don't want this particular email to have access. I'm going to go ahead and remove it by clicking on this X. You see, it says remove user, remove yourself from YouTube tutorials. You lose access to this account and the associated content, including YouTube and Google my business. And I'm going to go ahead and confirm that by pressing remove and I no longer have access to this account anymore. So hopefully you found everything you needed in this video. And if you did, why don't you do everything that you would usually do? My light went out, but I'm gonna keep talking anyway. Why don't you do everything that you would usually do when you like a video, which I hope just ain't thinking in your head this was a good video. You know, actually press the like button and maybe subscribe to the channel if you like it enough. So thanks for watching.